Hello, my name is Bernard Johnson. Today, I'll be sharing a short message on growing in Christ to teach kids how to grow strong with the Lord. Today's scripture reading will be coming from Ephesians 4, 14 through 15. And it reads, As a result, we aren't supposed to be infants any longer who can be tossed and blown around by every wind that comes from teaching with deceitful scheming and the tricks people play to deliberately mislead others. Instead, by speaking the truth with love, let's grow in every way into Christ. Word of God for the people of God. Is anybody here hungry? I know sometimes it's hard to sit through church without a snack, so I thought I'd bring a little something along this morning. Are you guys hungry? All right. Who wants some string peas or maybe mixed vegetables or look, broccoli? What's the matter? Is there something wrong with this food? You bet there is. This is baby food, isn't it? And you guys don't want to eat baby food anymore. Why? Because you guys aren't babies. You're all grown up and you can eat grown up food. What's your favorite food? Is it pizza or maybe hamburgers? How about hot dogs or macaroni and cheese? I love all that stuff too. I wonder though, do you guys like oysters or how about a salad? Does anyone eat salad? What about Indian food or Japanese food? Some of you guys might grow into those type of foods one day, but right now you found your ideal menu, haven't you? You know something? This baby food reminds me of when I first became a Christian. The Bible says, when you accept Jesus as your Lord and Savior, you are born again. That makes you a baby Christian, doesn't it? And everyone knows a baby needs baby food. But there's something else we can learn from this baby food. We have to grow up sometimes, don't we? Because you don't see your parents sitting down to enjoy a nice jar of string peas, do you? That's why it's important that you don't stop learning about Jesus after you've accepted him as your savior. You need to study the Bible, spend time in prayer, in Sunday school, and worship God. This is the spiritual food you need to grow strong in the Lord. Just as real food helps your body grow, I would like to challenge you guys, don't get stuck in the baby food stage. Seek God with all your heart, because if you do, the Bible promises that you will no longer be infants tossed back and forth by the waves. Thank you.